My boyfriend, M27, wants me, F26, to lose weight but gets upset when the number drops. My boyfriend, M27, wants me, 26F, to lose weight. I'm 5 apostrophe 4 ish and 124 pounds. It may seem like a healthy weight but I've always carried weight differently, meaning I do have a bit of a belly, bigger thighs and arm fat. When we first got together I was almost 140. I work out weekdays, I can't remember the last time I've had junk food or even a soda but my pants size isn't going down, Terry's not noticeable change and it upsets him. He says he'll love me at any weight but whenever the topic of me losing weight comes up and I tell him how the scale or doctors say I've lost weight he gets frustrated. Accusing the doctor of lying to me or me changing the scale. He's actually bought a different scale before because he says it was broken. I was 130 at the time. Mind you, I may look a bit chubby but I definitely don't look obese or extremely overweight. My doctor says I'm at a normal and healthy weight. On to tonight, I came home from the gym and just wanted a shower and a hot meal I was exhausted from work. He comes downstairs and greets me while I'm heating up a leftover steak. He gets upset and tells me I've been getting bigger and how I should have made a healthy choice. I got pissed and told him to bring the scale out, I got onto it and lost 2 pounds since last week. Once again he thinks it's broken and hasn't been speaking to me. I understand he's frustrated but how does he think I feel knowing my sizes aren't going down? I wear a M or L and a size 78 in pants, how do I speak to him about it? I've tried to communicate about how he makes me feel and how I'm trying. Edit, typos. Update, all the comments have opened my eyes so much. I sat him down and told him how what he's doing isn't normal and if he really loved me he would encourage me not to grade me because I'm not skinny enough for his liking. I told him if it continues I would be moving out and that I'm tired of being treated this way. The whole conversation he was silent till I mentioned moving out and he asked if I was seriously upset, I told him he makes me feel awful about my body. He told me he was just looking out for my health but if I feel that way I should leave. He told me to grab all of it because he'll be getting the locks changed. I called a couple of friends and he left while I packed. I have everything important and my cat. We're staying with a friend till I find a new apartment, thank you all so much. Why are you with a person who literally weighs you? He is going to cause you to have an eating disorder. I don't see how you can safely stay with him. You are a perfectly normal weight. He seems very shallow. Is this someone you really want in your future? He, weighs you? He, gives you the silent treatment? He, disbelieves literal facts? Weight on the scale could not be more objective and yet he still has you questioning yourself. Girl the amount of times you clarify that you know you could lose more weight or that you know. You're still chubby makes it sound like you just constantly put yourself down. Love yourself more than this. What he is doing is so abnormally awful that there is literally no way he could be a good person. You should only date good people. Don't date him. Hashtag maths. Um, why are you with someone like that? Would you want the father of your kids to talk to them like that? I have a great way for you to lose some weight fast drop the controlling body image obsessed. Boyfriend and move on with your life. You don't need that noise. It's not the scale that's broken. It's the man. You're putting in the work and he should respect that effort. He's being a massive dick and you deserve a whole lot more respect than what he's giving you. Eat him to assert dominance. For real, though, this is not acceptable behavior on his part. From what you've described, he sounds overly invested in your body weight in a way that comes off as controlling. I find it especially worrisome that he gives you the silent treatment when he's upset at you. I think you should tell him that. While you're appreciative of his concern about your health, your health is between you and your doctor. Be firm and kind but be ready to remind him if it's necessary. I really hope you two come to a helpful and stress-free resolution to this issue. I'm 5 feet 4 and 140 pounds and beautiful. 
I can't imagine you being anything less than gorgeous. Your man is insecure. Dump him before you're in too deep. The doctor is lying? The scale is broken? This is some hardcore gaslighting. This man is trying to mess with your head on purpose and is attempting to make you feel inadequate and self-conscious. He's not a good guy. I'm sorry to say. And sadly, you cannot converse a man like this out of his toxic behaviors. You speak to him about it like this. Respectfully F you and kick rocks. Your BF is trash and you need to drop the weight of him trailing behind you whining about a body that a good man would love to have and appreciate. Love yourself because he's going to send you into some serious body image issues. You are a perfectly normal weight. And your boyfriend is using this as a basis for abusing you. You get that, right? This is just abuse. Plain and simple. Your partner has no justification for caring about your weight. And the number on the scale is absolutely none of his business. He's, waste basket. Get as far away as possible from this guy. He is giving you an eating disorder. You are a perfectly healthy weight. Especially for someone regularly exercising at your height. Muscle weighs more than fat FFS. Look, I'm 5 feet 2 inches 130. And strong. Do you want your body to be able to do stuff? Run, jump, lift freaking live or do you want your body to be a trophy on his wall while he belittles and bullies you hell if you weighed 300 pounds how he speaks to you still wouldn't be okay that's not what love looks like also imagine staying with this guy imagine recovering from pregnancy and birth how long would he wait to start harassing you about losing the baby weight what if you had complications he doesn't want you to lose weight. He wants you to feel bad about yourself so you won't think you deserve better. Guy here. The weight you need to lose is probably 160 pounds of boyfriend. You're working out and are healthy. If he is that focused on how you're not acceptable in his eyes, he should not be acceptable in yours. You can do better. How is this man still alive? There are too many blunt objects around my house for me to ever dare implying such a thing to a girlfriend. How tall is he? Is he muscular? It's time to start comparing him to guys at the gym. He doesn't love you no matter what your body looks like. Or what you weigh. You lost almost 20 pounds for him. Which you should only ever do for yourself and only for healthy reasons. And because you are naturally curvy and he's too blind with shallow selfishness. He can't see what's right in front of him. You are perfect as is. He'll never be satisfied. He doesn't love you. He loves some fantasy of what he thinks you should be in order to make him happy. A fantasy most likely based off of porn or some unrealistic appearance he idolizes. You've tried to make him see how this makes you feel. And he doesn't listen. He won't. You can't make him do something he doesn't want to do. How is that love? This is honestly the case of people not knowing that women can all carry their weight differently. He's focusing on specific areas to tell you that you aren't losing weight ignoring you as a whole. Honestly this seems pretty toxic. He isn't your doctor and therefore should not be giving you health advice after you have already seen a doctor. He seems like the kind of guy that lusts after women with extreme eating disorders and thinks that their bodies at that moment are peak. And when they are at a stable and healthy weight she is fat. I would have the calm conversation with him. Lots of commenters have given you solid advice. However I would ask if you plan on having kids? Because he's the type of guy that'll make a scene over a pregnant weight gain. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epicaracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.